Welcome to Code with Miracle channel. Today we are going to learn Python data types. We have different data types in Python such as string, number, list, tuple, dictionary, set, and boolean. Now let's get started with string. You can define a string using double quote or single quote, it doesn't matter. But if you have a case where you have a string that contains single quote and you want to represent the data as it is then you want to specify the string inside double quote like how I specified this here you can see I have a single quote inside string so I use double quote to represent it then uh, this is used to represent multi-line string uh, if you have a long uh, string or a long sentence uh, then you want to specify this in your variable then you can use uh, this multi-line string format where you want to specify a double or single quote three times then you want to specify the text now let's run this code here you can see right it's almost similar to the one which we did in our code and one more thing I want to say in this video is that in C or C++ we define data type like uh, integer then variable name equal to value whereas in Python you don't need to define data type. Data type is being observed based on the value that means Python is a dynamically typed language it extract data type or it knows this data is belong to this data type based on its value like if you see this uh, data here it is being surrounded with double quote so python assume this is as a string data whereas if we move into number then you can see this is a number so python assume it as integer here you can see it as decimal point so python see it has a float point likewise we have complex number so python has three different type in number integer decimal complex number then we are going to move into list list is used to define more than one variable say if you take programming languages then it, uh, it will have uh, more than 10 or there exist many languages to define that string is not a best option so we have list in python there you can specify multiple uh, items in a single variable like how i stored python node.js closure c c++ java in a single variable called programming languages and for list we use square bracket whereas for tuple we use round brackets this is how we define a tuple in python the difference between list and tuple is list is mutable whereas tuple is immutable that means if you if i want to change the value of first index node.js where i want to change a small letter js to capital letter js then it is possible in list whereas if you perform the same operation on tuple then you will see the difference like it will throw you an error like tuple object doesn't support item assignment so please keep this in mind if you are going with tuple don't assign the values like this if you want to assign this value dynamically then please go for less now let's move into dictionary dictionary is en enclosed with curly braces it's basically a key value pair where will have a key and value and it doesn't allow duplicates that means if I use the same key like I have used H Python is case sensitive so it should be the same then only uh, we can uh, Python can understand that this both key is same here I have specified it as 18 and uh, I have saved it now let's run 
here you can see the difference now instead of 21 it printed 18 it is because it overrided the uh, next value overrided the previous value that's why we got 18 instead of 21 this is dictionary now let's move into set we use set to remove duplicate value or to store uh, unique values in that case we use set here you can see i have uh, multiple values like uh, 10 20 30 here 10 20 got repeated now if you add this in a curly brace then you can see the difference it removed the duplicates and printed you as 10 20 and 30 this is the difference and one more thing you have to notice here is uh, both dictionary and set uses curly braces the difference there is dictionary is being defined by key value pair whereas set we define values directly how like how we define on list there exists another method uh, there exists another way like uh, there exists a built-in function called set using that also you can create set now let's move into boolean basically boolean is a true or false it could be either true or false this is one of the data type in python uh, this kind of data you will get when you compare two values here you can see if I compare 20 and 20 obviously it would be true if I compare 20 with 21 then I run then it would be false and if you want to know the type of the data like uh, if I want to know the type of S2 then I want to specify type of S2 this will let me know the type of the data here you can see it is of type set now let's check with the complex number this would be better example type of complex number now save and run here you can see it will say class of complex this is how we use a uh, type in python type is a built-in function in python thanks for watching please subscribe go to the miracle channel and in future videos we will see in detail about each of this topic string number this double dictionary set boolean since this is an introduction video i just covered basics